Let's make double jump in Unreal Engine 5. It is very simple and easy to do. Let's get started. Let's make a new Unreal Engine 5 project. From games, I will select the first person template and name my project first person game. Create. Now from the content drawer, let's go to the blueprints folder. Here in the blueprints folder, let's select this BP first person character. Double click to open it. Now let's arrange this tab here. If we scroll, we can find the jump logic. We need to change this logic in order to add the ability to double jump. Now two nodes will be very useful for us for adding double jump easily. One of them is uh, do n. I'm going to type here do n without space. Here is this. This node allows us to do something, anything that is connected to the spin n number of times. I'm going to enter two here. So it will allow us to do whatever we connect here two times and then it will not allow us to do it again till we reset it. So if we jumped twice or if we uh, double jumped once, we won't be able to jump again if we don't reset it. So we will have to reset it as well. Also it gives us access to this counter. A number that will be 1 on the first run, it will be 2 on the second run and so on. Now there will be another node that will be very useful to us and it will be switch on integer, switch on int. This node lets us do different things based on uh, different values of a number. We need to add some pins, I am going to add 3 pins here. We're not going to use this zero pin here. We will use only one and two. Now, based on this number, it will let us do these different things. So if it is one, it will let us do this one, whatever is connected to this pin. If it is two, it will let us do whatever is connected to this pin. So let's connect this counter to selection. That way, if uh, it is the first uh, execution, if it is the first run of this, after reset, if it is the first run of this node, the selection here will be the counter, which will be one. So it, it will let us do whatever is connected to this, this pin here. And on the second time, similarly, it will let us do whatever is connected to this pin here. Let's connect the exit to switch on int. Now I'm going to right click here and break this link and I will take this jump and connect it to the first pin here. Now I'm going to click here on this little arrow and we are going to connect started this started pin to this 2n enter. I will collapse it again by clicking here. Now when this selection is 2, I want to use a different node for the second jump and that will be launch character. This node allows us to add some velocity to our character and I will add some velocity on the z direction. Let's add 600. Now again we want to reset this, else if we don't reset it, we won't be able to jump more than two times. So let's look for event on landed. So when our character lands, when our character is landed, we want to reset our to and node that is for the double jump. Now this is how easy it is to make double jump in Unreal Engine. Let's try it, combine, save, go to the map, play the game and uh, if we try to jump, 
so we can jump twice and if we try to jump more than twice we cannot do that till we land and if after we land we can jump again we can double jump we can jump once so this is how we can add double jump in unreal engine 5 it is this simple and we are done here but after this i like to do two more things the first thing is i don't like the default gravity for my project so i'm going to increase the gravity scale so if we go back to the first person character blueprint we have this character movement component here if we click here we can see gravity scale now for my project i like 2.3 you can keep it to 1 if you want and if we change this gravity here then i don't use this uh, jump here i like to use the same launch character node here so i connected both one and two to the same node launch character node because i want both of these uh, jumps to be kind of similar and instead of 600 i will make it 900 If you don't have any reason to change the gravity scale by default, it's probably a better idea to keep it at default value, that is 1. But for my project, I just like this 2.3 value. So we have to be careful when we change the gravity scale, if we, if we are also changing it in the blueprint in some other place. We have to keep track of the original value and so on. Now you don't have to do this, it's just something that I like to do for my projects. So I changed the gravity to 2.3, I connected both of these pins to the same launch character node that is uh, launching in the Z direction with 900 velocity. Let's try it. So I like this one better. You can try different numbers and see what works well for you. So this is our double jump in Unreal Engine 5. If you liked my video, please subscribe to my channel and share my videos with your friends and fellow game developers. I will see you in the next video. Have a great day.